Hey guys, Andre here. Today we'll check uh, these three small amps. Uh, actually, I have a surprise. There will be a fourth amp that I will not reveal, just in the end. Um, and actually, I challenge you to, um, before I reveal which letter belongs to which amp, write in the comment section, like in order, uh, uh, which do you like the most. And in the end, uh, let's see. Uh, if you have a surprise or not, okay? Uh, these amps are going through a cabinet loaded with V30 uh, slash and vintage speakers. They were all recorded with a Shure SM57 um, and I didn't even touch the mic, so um, that's what it is. So let's see which do you like the most. Have fun! Hey guys, uh, I bet you wanna know uh, which is the fourth amp, so let me show you. Here is my fourth amp. Yeah, the Helix and the Friedman, the Dirty Shirley. Yeah, I use it a lot uh, and I think it's a killer combo. Uh, it feels like an amp, it sounds like an amp, uh, it's really great, uh, you should give it a try. Um, and that's it. Uh, so, uh, the pros, well, the three are super compact, uh, super lightweight, the prices, um, I think uh, the PRS is the, really the best bang for the buck of the three because uh, the construction is just like the, the Victory, it's a good construction, solid construction, really the knobs doesn't feel, nothing feels cheap in this amp, uh, in this tool. Of course the Friedman uh, has a, a better construction uh, and a lot of details, well the, it's a boutique amp so uh, it's more expensive because of that too um, but I think the, you have this difference because uh, these two are British style amps they sound really British 
and this not. Uh, uh, this one has a lot of gain. Uh, it's the louder of the three. Uh, it's loaded with 6L6. Uh, Both of the three are uh, super versatile. In the end, I think you, you guys need to, uh, to know what you guys want. Okay? Uh, so, I bought the Friedman. This is my actual amp. Uh, this is for my body, uh, my team mate of, of my band, and this is for a good, a good friend of mine. Um, what I can tell you is, I did prefer to wait uh, and save uh, money for buy uh, and end box the, the, the treatment because I knew it's the, the tone uh, that I wanted. Uh, I will review it um, and you will see uh, the dynamic and the, uh, so, so the peak, uh, the, the way the, this amp responds to your peak is unbelievable. Uh, uh, you can not put this amp sounding bad, uh, it's, it's insane. And that's all guys, uh, I hope you enjoy it. Um, I will do a more in-depth review of these amps uh, because in this kind of videos you just can hear the tone differences uh, between the, these amps. Um, so I really want to show you uh, the tons of differences uh, to justify the, the price difference uh, that they have. So if you like it, please uh, subscribe and give me your thumbs up uh, and I see you in the next video. Take care.